Hello everyone, I'm Ryan Kartsky with AutoAnything.com and we are wrapping up our 2015 Chevy Silverado build. Today we're upgrading all of our auxiliary lighting and electrical with a dual battery system. Now starting under the hood, we've got an Optima yellow top battery which is going to power all of our auxiliary components and off-road lights. Now all of the wiring for that is being run through the brand new Switch Pros 8100 control module. Now the Switch Pros is a really unique product. It basically does all of our electrical and wiring management in a simple and easy to use configuration. There's a control module right here which everything gets wired into. There are eight separate channels which can handle a total of 100 amps and there's a single channel that can actually support up to 30 amps of draw. So if you have a very high power off-road light, you can hook it up through that one channel. Now all the wiring happens here and then there's a single cable that runs into the inside of the cabin where you can control all of the lighting via switch control panel. Now let's hop inside and I'll show you some of the bells and whistles. So here's where we've installed the panel for our Switch Pros 8100. As you can see it's got eight different buttons and each one is programmable so you can be either on off, flash or stroke if you want to throw a disco party. Now, there's built-in low voltage disconnect to protect your battery from getting fully drained and you can power this with either battery or switched ignition. And when I say these buttons are fully programmable, I mean just that. You can program each button to turn on a combination of accessories without touching any of the wiring. And you can do that using your smartphone. So for example, let's say zombies are overrunning your town and you want to turn on every light on your vehicle, you can program just one button to do that and you don't even have to touch any of the wiring makes all of this very simple and painless to install. Now let's hop outside the vehicle and I'll show you what we've got powered up. All right, so here's a look at all the lights we've got installed on the front of this truck and I've got Switch Pros hooked up on my phone so I can control it all remotely. So right on the bumper, we've got a Pro Z 22 inch double row LED light bar hooked up with combination optics. So in the center is a spot and then on the outsides is a floodlight. Boom, nice and bright. On top of that, we've got these T-Rex Torch Series LEDs that came installed in the grill. Now these are a nice complement that also go along with the front bumper lights. And in addition to that, we've got these LED fog lights installed courtesy of Iron Cross. And because you can never have enough light, we installed a 50 inch double row light bar up top on the roof that will illuminate everything ahead of us. All right, let's head around the back and I'll show you some of the lights we got hooked up there. Now underneath the rear Iron Cross bumper, we've installed two Pro-Z LED light cubes. It uses backup and rock lights. This will really illuminate everything behind the truck and make it super easy to see what's behind us. Now I've got one more light to show you guys and it's in the truck bed. We've got this X-Tang E-Light 500 installed in the truck bed as a utility flashlight. Now this is a pretty quality little flashlight made by Rigid Industries got three LEDs and it's extremely bright. You can definitely light up any little job you got, whether you're working in the truck bed, under the hood, or anywhere else.